Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So how's everybody doing on this Monday? I'm doing good. It's another cold, rainy, yucky day. I was going to get back to walking because I missed every day last week because I wasn't feeling so good, but not today because uh, I just looked on my tablet and right now it is 1.50, well, it's 2 o'clock p.m. here and this is our weather right now. I know, I know it's, I live in South Carolina and that's, that's chilly for this area. It's 40, light rain showers, and it feels like 38, so no walking for me today. But anyway, I wanted to come on here and do my three item review that I do every other Monday. Um, I uh, take three items and I rate them my opinion of some things I've never tried before. Um, I do a rating scale of 1 to 10, 1 being terrible, 10 being awesome, delicious. And so, anyway, now I opened it up already, and I'm trying this. This is those um, ice latte chilled coffee drinks that you get at the Dollar Tree. Um, now these were just a dollar, and um, you know I like those uh, Starbucks frappuccinos you buy. At, you know, get them at the gas station or whatever. But good grief, them things are like. Um, what almost three dollars so let's try this here i haven't never tried them i've seen them every once in a while my store sells out of them quick so okay <laughs> i don't know it's okay i don't taste much much uh, coffee flavor Kind of reminds me of a, kind of reminds me of a Yoo-Hoo. <laughs> you know, those chocolate drinks. It's okay. Would I buy them again? I don't know. They're all right. I mean, uh, it's okay. Uh, <laughs> that's all I can say is, uh. Alrighty, well, I went ahead and opened these. Now, I didn't try them. I just, you know, saved some time here and noise. But I got, I felt, I see a lot of people haul these. These are those pop corners. Uh, they're, these are the sweet and salty kettle corn. Um, I guess it'd be like popcorn. So, I thought I'd give them a try. They smell good. They smell like, uh, sort of like butter popcorn. Okay. But I've always seen them and I've never tried them. So, anyway, that's what they look like. And it says there's only, um, uh, it's never fried, only four ingredients. Okay. So. good I like that wow those are really good hmm. wow I like them a lot okay it says um they only it's only got yellow corn sunflower oil cane sugar and sea salt and you could have this whole bag it's only 360 calories but if you eat 17 chips it's 120 calories uh four grams of fat no cholesterol 20 grams of carbs and uh three grams of total sugar which is good i like those a lot hmm, wow i seen another flavor there. Uh, I think it was just, I don't remember what it was, but yeah, those are really good. I like them. They've got a good flavor. They're not too salty, not too sweet. Alrighty, and the next thing I picked up, I got these at the um, Walmart the other day. I don't go to Walmart much. I may go once, twice a month. 
but over in the deli section, you know, where you get your chicken and your sliced meat and stuff, you know, you got that counter, the little refrigerator section there where they sell the already made salads and subs and stuff. Well, I found these on top, and what got me was the name. <laughs> Carolina Dirt Barbecue Kettle Chips. Carolina Dirt. And as you know, I was born and raised in the mountains of North Carolina, but I live in South Carolina now. And that's what got me was the name, Carolina Dirt. But these were not cheap. This little bag, it's uh, 1.375 ounces, was it was right around a dollar fifty-seven for this little bag of chips. So, but it's um, it says uh, back home in Greenville, South Carolina, Grandma Lily taught Charlie the art of using authentic, original, inspired Southern flavor to serve up taste and traditions all their own. Okay. And they got different flavors. They got hot pepper vinegar. Now, I did see that one. They got pimento cheese, sea salt, black pepper, buttermilk, sweet onion, and original. Now, the pimento cheese sounds good in the sea salt and black pepper. But I'm not crazy about anything that's like onion. I love onions, but no, I don't think that sweet onion. I'd be willing to try the hot pepper vinegar. Alrighty, well, let's give us a try. Don't have a full smell, but you sure don't get a lot in the bag. Look at that. For <laughs> Okay. Alrighty. Yeah, I saw that name. I was like, wow, Carolina Dirt. It says, named for our famous barbecue rub in Carolina's clay-colored soil. Which is true. There's a lot of clay in, in South Carolina. Red clay mud. Okay. Well, let me get a bigger one. I can't see that one. Well, is there any big ones in there? Here we go. Here we go. Got a lot of uh, powder on it. Dust. Whatever you want to call it. Pretty good. It's a, wow. Hmm. Can't tell what I'm tasting. It's like a barbecue chip, but it's a little bit um, sweet. Got a sweet aftertaste. Wow. Pretty good. Got the shakes today. Pretty good. Okay. Don't have many ingredients in it. Um, potato, sunflower and canola oil, salt, paprika and other spices, sugar, brown sugar, dehydrated onion and garlic. Okay, they're good. Would I buy them again? No, not for that price. And not, <laughs> you don't get that many. I mean, that's uh, right there. And I only ate, what, one? Now that's uh, how many you get. But they're good. Yeah. Alrighty, guys. Well, let me give you my uh, rating on everything. Okay, for the uh, Dollar Tree. I don't know what that V stands for. Victoria something. Can't see that. Caramel, iced, latte, chilled coffee drink. It's okay. I'll give it a six. Would I buy it again? No. I might try the vanilla one. It's all right. No. I'll, no, I wouldn't buy it again. So that's a six. Okay. For the pop corners. So, sweet and salty kettle corn. I'll give this, I like these a lot. I'm going to give this a eight. Eight and a half. Yeah, eight and a half. These are good. I like them because they're not real sweet. They're not real salty. They're light. I like them. They don't have a lot of sugar in them. And they're not that fattening. <laughs> so these are eight and a half. 
okay? And for the Carolina Dirt, Carolina Dirt Barbecue Kettle Chips, <sighs> they're okay. Well, no, they're really good. I'll give them an eighth. Would I buy them again? No, not for that price. I mean, you could go buy the Walmart brand or whatever, and, but no, these are good, though. All right, guys. Well, that was my review for this week, and I hope everybody enjoys the rest of your Monday. I've been doing some crafting. I'll be showing that Friday. I'm going to start a new, now that it's February, I'm going to try to get back on track. I'm just going to give you a little hint. Ta -da! <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to do that on Fridays. I'm going to start doing a Friday project here. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoy the rest of your Monday. Everybody take care out there. Stay safe. And until next time, guys, bye.